Okay, Christina and I are just getting ready to leave the Ironwood Hotel here in Takloban in northern Leyte, Leyte province. What can I say about the Ironwood Hotel? It's coming in at about $100 Canadian, so it does not qualify as a cheap hotel, as you might imagine. It is, however, a higher standard of a place than we generally stay at. So a nice bench, that nice desk for me to work at, a full length mirror, and this is a first, a, That's a plus. weighing scale, which Christine and I enjoyed because we now know what we weigh after two months, two months on the road. What else do we have here that's kind of interesting? A fridge. We have a water boiler, which is which is great, a big plus. We have lots of plug-ins uh, all over the place. Plug-in, plug-in, plug-in. Big screen TV. We were watching, I think we were watching Netflix last night, right? Yeah. Some nice, interesting art on the wall. Lots of plug-ins over here. A view out the window of the surrounding town. The town is fantastic. Tacloban has this history of one of the largest typhoons ever to hit a city. The weather was pretty good. This harbor here is quite sheltered, so there wasn't like big waves. And even though people had been born, there was a super typhoon, it still took a lot of people by surprise because of the nice weather. Now we found this out just you know, th this is the views of the people we spoke to down at the memorial to all the people lost. So people in general, the most deadly thing actually wasn't the wind. The deadly thing was a massive storm surge in the lower parts of the city. And the death toll, the low end of the death toll is just over 5,000 people. Official toll comes in just under 6,000. 6, Can you imagine that? And this city is only, I don't know, several, it's not that big. It's certainly much smaller than Vancouver. Can you imagine? Vancouver has, BC faces our big weather events, our forest fires, which are disastrous. But can you imagine a weather event that comes in and takes between 5,000 and 10,000 people? Absolutely terrible. And that was 10 years ago. And so we visited the, the city 10 years later. And it's pretty hard to tell, you know, a lot of things are back to repair. The waterfront, large areas are leveled and will not be coming back. We're told that the plan is to have a park in, uh, in, in those areas. And so Tacloban is a very interesting town in that respect. It has a lot of restaurants and a lot of students here. So we're here for two nights and it was a very interesting stay as we walked around the town. We also did a lot of just straightening up work here because, you know, we're traveling quite fast right now. We're generally only staying one night in the town. We stayed two nights here to get, to get speeded up. So this is our $100 a night place. Best free, quote, free, <laughs> free, complimentary. free, complimentary breakfast I think I've ever had anywhere any place. Spectacular complimentary breakfast. So that's what basically what I want to say about the Ironwood. It did what I needed to do. I should say that though that there's some things that you know could not be overcome it seems and t like I say Tacloban took a tremendous blow here 10 years ago. So one of the things is you can't use the water in this in the sinks. You have to buy bottled water, even if you're boiling. You're not quite sure what's wrong with the water, so that's the first time we've done that. We've usually made water uh, uh, coffee out of the sink and just boil the heck out of it. Have that a problem? But here, with that sign, that was a problem. The other one was the internet. The internet you can kind of get, but most of the time I just ran off my phone hotspot because the internet was so was so crappy here that I, that that part I wasn't expecting I was expecting with a you know a hotel that looks this fine to be able to use the internet and most of the times we could we couldn't do that so yeah a sobering experience to be in a city that got hit so hard by a super super typhoon interesting experience as usual 
interactions with people on the street are amazing, just really gentle, nice, friendly people, and the same, and of course the, the same with the staff here. That's my fe feelings. I think feelings is a good word to use in a city tackle open that's faced so much tragedy. That's my feelings about this place, but we're all waiting to hear what is Christina's rating of the Ironwood Hotel and her stay here in the beautiful city of Tuckaloven. Yesterday I was going to only give 1.5 thumbs, thumbs up, because there's no hot water yesterday and a very crappy, crappy Wi-Fi. And that television didn't work at all yesterday, right? But last night it worked. Just the regular TV, but no internet still didn't work. Because of the beautiful complimentary breakfast. I don't even want to get out of that buffet <laughs> room. I'm giving them two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. And that up. breakfast is spectacular. Spectacular. <laughs> and, and whoever thought about putting that weighing scale and that big mirror there, very nice. That yeah. person is a genius. <laughs> I was even going to the hospital here just to say, can I weigh myself? <laughs> it's a genius. So two thumbs up, right? Beautiful staff. It's always the staff that makes the place for me, you know. Yeah, it's really nice. Comfortable bed. There's a construction going on up on the fourth floor, but didn't really bother us at all. It's a lot yeah. of hammering. Yeah, you can hear it. It's Well, there's hammering, but not a lot of hammering. You know, coming yeah. from Canada, you'd expect to hear more power tools. Uh, yeah. There's very little yeah. sound, except what sounds like a single hammer that, that, that works for at least eight hours a yes. day. <laughs> yeah, it didn't bother us at all. So that's our stay at the Ironwood Hotel. Totally recommend this place. Christina gives it two thumbs up, and I and I absolutely See, agree. Look Tap at me, look at me, look at me. Ooh. Look how happy. See? <laughs> it's worth every penny because of that rain scale. Takloban. If you're anywhere near, come see this town. It's got quite the story, a disaster that hit, tragedy really that hit, and then a town that rebuilt in a neat way. Takloba, really glad we came here. Oh, we are heading for Baasa. 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 We're going to go to the bus depot first. We left the Ironwood Hotel. Enjoying all her 